Hey everyone, I wanted to finish up from the f previous video as we discussed self-disclosure and routine assessment and feedback. Um, regarding self-disclosure, like I mentioned in the previous video, it's really about how much you feel comfortable sharing. Now, with that though, some people feel more comfortable sharing than others about their life and some people are just open books. So you really have to you really have to have some boundaries with how much you are willing to share and you have to be aware of your surroundings and the environment uh, regarding the session with your clients about how much you share so if the self-disclosure you're giving could be beneficial for the client then by all means give it um, but if you're giving information about yourself to the client and it's constant then this then you're you're not doing the right thing with the client you're actually creating harm in the relationship so you want to make sure that any self disclosure you give is brief to the point and it serves some type of purpose to help the client all right, enough said about that. Routine assessment and feedback. Now, as you are meeting with the client, you're going to be doing assessments in your in your mind as you learn uh, different assessments, and um, you'll also do formal assessments depending upon what type of field you're working in. And the question comes up: Do you share those assessments with the client? And my response is: It depends. <laughs> uh, professionally, I would. I would share some of the information that I've gathered because to me I think it's rude to request data and information um, that can be very personal to someone right away without giving some type of feedback about its purpose and and how it's going to benefit the client but I know that agencies have various policies on this and so you want to refer to those but um, I would say if possible have a discussion with the client it doesn't mean you have to turn over the assessment and give them all the information but you can summarize the purpose of it and, and what your findings are based on on the assessment and I think that that's gonna help build trust with the client as well um, so I think those are the points I want to make in this video and again if you have questions concerns comments about <clears throat> about the material up to this point please reach out please reach out i i am here to help you and uh you know i'll do whatever i can to to make sure that you you're getting the material and that um you're moving forward all right see you in the next one